Good day. In this lecture video, we will be talking about tautologies and contradictions. Okay, so I think tautology might be new to you. So tautology is just um, a proposition. For example, you have compound proposition that composed of P, Q, and more that are always true. So tautologies are just propositions that are always true. In the truth table, their last result should always be true. Okay, so it says here, only has true at the last com column of their truth table. So for example, we have this proposition. We have the P, which says the dog is brown, and the not P, which is the dog is not brown. If we use the OR, logical operation in this we will have this truth table so this is the p or not p and it will result in a value that is always true so basically if we read this you know we will have in this one using the or logical connective we will have the dog is either brown or the dog is not brown. So it actually is true. As you can see, we use the or here. We use the or. So one of this could be true, right? So if the dog is not brown, then if the dog is brown, then of course it is not brown. Uh, if the dog is brown, then of course course there is another color there which can be represented in the dog is not brown so in either way the dog could be brown or not brown and since we used or one could be true basically the statement is always true for example if you say that i could love you or not love you is always true right yeah you could say nga, crush na ko siya, or di na ko siya crush, is always true. So that is actually a tautology. Okay, there are many tautologies out there. Uh, you, you will encounter problems that has tautologies. And um, just keep that in mind, the tautologies are propositions that are always true. Okay, so tautologies have this principle of substitution. That is, uh, no matter what the, your P and Q are, if uh, the entire proposition is already a tautology, then that means uh, even if you change your P and Q, it is still a tautology. Okay, so it says here that if we have a proposition or compound proposition that composed of P, Q, and more, and it is a tautology, then, for example, we have another proposition, compound proposition, P that contains P1 and P2, then we say that um, that P, this one, is still a tautology. Though we substituted p and q with p1 p2 and more since the entire proposition compound proposition is already a tautology then it should be a tautology okay so that is the principle of substitution now the opposite of a tautology is the contradiction so what is a contradiction again the opposite of tautology meaning that no matter what its value is always false. It says there that contains only F in the last column of its truth table. In other words, if it is false for any truth value of its variable. So here is an example. The P and not P again. The dog is brown and the dog is not brown. If we use the logical connective end in these propositions, we have the dog is brown and not brown. If you read the statement, immediately you will say, no, this can't be valid. That is why it is always 
was because there cannot be an object that is brown and not brown at the same time right there cannot exist an object that is uh, big and small at the same time or clean and dirty at the same time so there can't be an object that is that contains the opposite of itself so that's why it is always false okay so a tautology is always true a contradiction is always false okay so that is the contradiction okay so here is a final note on tautologies so if a proposition is called valid so matawag na tong proposition is valid if it is a tautology so if you are provided with uh, for example propositions and you will find its truth table and you say and you see that all of its finals truth value are true then we can conclude that that proposition is valid now if you are provided with another proposition and that one of its final solution is true the rest are false or two or more or one or more of its solutions are true then we can say that that proposition is satisfiable meaning that a proposition is satisfiable if it is not a contradiction okay so not a contradiction meaning it is not all false do you understand now so valid meaning all of its values are true and then a satisfiable meaning some of its values are true not all but some of its value are true okay so that is all for tautologies and contradictions and see you on the next lecture video